Community of Boston, Kentucky and Nelson County is mourning an eight year old child tonight. Landon McCubbins died late last night after an accident that happened at school. WHS 11 night teams Tom Lally sat down with his family to learn what happened and how he's being remembered. He just loved everyone around him. Landon McCubbins was the oldest of four siblings, a good friend and classmate, but most of all, his family says he was loved. We never would have thought that we would bury him. We would thought, you know, he would be burying all of us because that's how it's supposed to work. Eight-year-old Landon was at Boston school on Monday when his mom says he started to choke. She drove straight over and was with him as they went from the hospital and then were flown to Norton Children's where eventually she learned he had lost too much oxygen. She also said it was a bouncy ball that he'd been choking on. He just choked on a ball, something you never think, you know, that a kid that age would, you know, we would have to worry about something like that. The school sent this letter home Tuesday saying Landon was loved deeply by his classmates and teachers, and he was a great hugger who had a passion for farming. His family owns the Bellwood Farm in Bardstown. Keep sharing those stories, keep his memory alive. You know, we just, we just want everyone to know how great our boy was. Community members have already set up funds for the family's expenses through Liberty Tax Angels in Bardstown as the McCubbins unexpectedly plan Landon's funeral. You never could think that, you know, you would need to do something like this. You don't ever plan to bury a baby. Landon's family says they've been overwhelmed by neighbors, first responders, even the Boston School District stepping up to help, taking care of everything they can, including Thanksgiving dinner. In Bardstown, Tom Lally, the WHAS 11 night team, on your side.